What is up, guys? I was not expecting of making a video today because I'm lazy, <laughs> but um, we are going to do um, an Astro season. Why not? Even though this is the show 19, it's gonna start. We get in the year because uh, earlier this week they uh, got caught cheating. Yeah, we're gonna enter this game. Carlos Correa is up to bat. <laughs> I don't know. Alright. Ninth inning, no outs. And uh, the Strohs are losing 12 to 5. So the oh my gosh, no. My bad. Or I'll see you <laughs> after I'm done editing this. Okay, so we are back here. Oh, he's gone deep twice. Make it three times. Ah. Oh. This is the best camera angle. I am sorry, this will be the last time. Okay, now we are actually back. Um, I just haven't played Mobile Show with this account. Oh, we hit it. Oh, yes, and we are going to get to first with Carlos Correa. Sim to next appearance. Alex Bregman. Uh, I'm gonna decrease all the tutorials because I've played this game before. Run, 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 run! Ah! They get the double play. The Tampa Bay Rays. Ah, that's unfortunate. And they take the win away. Alright, that's unfortunate. We lose our first game of the year. <laughs> but, eh. I'm actually probably gonna skip all the other important ones because um, I just want to get through this season. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna sim to the end of the season and I will, or else sim to the All Star break. And I'll um, get to you after um, that. So I'm um, seeing a little bit. Well, for you guys, it'll be like a few seconds. For me, it'll be like a uh, little bit. <laughs> so, guys, we're coming back a little before the All Star break. I just turned everything to um, auto, and then apparently that changed um, this to. Uh, uh, changed this, uh, I have no idea what I'm about, oh, what I was about to say, but I guess it just turned on, and Alex Bregman needs a triple for the cycle, so I am going to look for that triple, Alex Bregman, oh, no, <sighs> uh, I swung with too much juice, and Alex Bregman gets a home run, not what I was looking for, but um, eh, it's fine. I mean, it's a home run. A home run's a home run, but oh, I'm playing third. Almora may run. May bunt. Yes, he is. Get the ball. Throw it to second. The out. Throws it to first. Oh, he's safe, though. Uh, all right. Well, anyway, got the force out, and ah, uh, we win without. Bregman getting his triple, but um, I guess this will just be the last uh, moment that I'll play, and I will just sim to the end of the season. I mean, this video is just for fun. I mean, I don't know why. There's pretty much no point behind this video, but um, uh, yeah, if you guys, uh, I don't know, want to see more uh stupid videos like this, <laughs> leave a like, and even if you don't, um. Leave a like to show support. And, uh, critique me in the comment section below. So, this time, hopefully, we, I will see you in the Hall Star break. Okay, guys, so we are back. And now, we are doing the, um, we are doing the, um, All Star game, and I just thought, why not to make this more interesting? Um, Am I not allowed to control any of these? 
In other Astros news, the club has made a trade and have acquired catcher Omar Narvaez, starting pitcher Oh, okay, we got someone. And, um, so, now I'm going to be using all these guys, my guy Reese Hoskins in the bottom, but, um, yeah, just to make this more interesting, and then I'm going to play the All-Star game, and then, because this game's, this video is going to be pretty boring. I'm just saying, because, I mean, it, there's no point behind it, but, I mean, why not? It's the, they're the, um... Um, Astros who just got caught cheating, so I just thought, why not just spice it up a little bit and do this? Um, and yeah, I guess we're starting. Now that the rules are clear, it's time for the home run derby. Let's see what he can do. All right, Reese. Reese Hoskins with the first home run. Yeah. Home run by Reese Hoskins. Oh. Big fella. Oh, yes, it is gone. Haha. <laughs> yes. Oh. Reese Hoskins go up, oh, taco for 360 feet. I am going to try with all the other guys, so this is not going to be biased at all. So. Oh, ah, no. Ah, uh, hits it foul. And we are going to call our timeout with a minute and seven seconds left. Just because... Uh, Reese Hoskins sees that Gatorade of his teammate coming up to him, Bryce Harper, giving him the Gatorade! 360, four, six, 300, 436 feet. I couldn't say that. Oh! Uh, Alright, 40 seconds left. Oh, and he hits it 460 feet to the stairs in right field. So now, oh, 417 feet this time. Wow, Hoskins hitting some bombs, seven home runs. Hopefully we can itch it to maybe nine before the end. Nah, that's not going to happen. Five, four, three, last hit, two, one. Nah, he hits it opposite field for foul. Now it's Chris Davis. Oh, it's that way foul. Oh my gosh, she's pulling these insanely in an insane amount. We've got to hit it opposite field. He still is pulling these. Like, this is going to be hard. Oh my goodness. They're going, like, behind him. I mean, I'm not being serious, but, like, jeez. And then, like, he's hitting them right to left field. Go for center. Maybe it'll itch. Nope. Keeps going to the left. I'll just keep trying to hit it towards left. Maybe it'll itch over. And, yes, finally, 412 feet. First home run. Just keeps pulling them into left field, and now it seems he's starting to get hot with a 440 foot home run. Second straight homer. Hit it for to center, that's where you hit it. Other one! Nope, he seems to pull him whenever you go to center. So, just try to. Oh, yes, it just itches fair. Well, that wasn't just, but still. I'm not, because I mean, it always looks like he's pulling these, so. Three home runs with a minute and 20 seconds left. Oh! We're going to eat it towards left field. Oh, oh, just barely. 405 feet. Oh. I wasn't paying attention there. Oh, and just itches fair again. Wow. His six. I'm going to. Oh. Should have caught a timeout before there, and he hits it foul. With a minute and 10 seconds left, or 11, I'm going to call a timeout. So now he's juiced up again. And oh, he's hitting that to opposite field. That's not going to make it, is it? 
Oh, I thought the two was just gonna have some late life and make it. So, Chris Davis hits it to right field, 417. He needs one more homer to beat Reese Hoskins, and that is what he does. I'm a little salty about that, but hey, what can you do? He faced off against the number one seed, so yeah. Um, to All right. Uh, congratulations on Jim him. Bird. Well, congratulations to me not Boston to be. All right. And J D Martinez. Ah, oh, pulls it. He seems like he's gonna pull it to me. So, hits it towards center. Tried to hit it towards center, and he just blasts it to left field. Wow. Trying for right field this time. And oh, he hits it opposite field, just barely missed. Oh my goodness, I have no idea. I accidentally pressed circle and it was a home run. So, I have no idea what is going on. Oh, just barely fell. Oh. Short again. Oh, it's it to center field, 397 feet. A little bit of a slow start. Uh, goes foul. And oh, another one to center field, 394. Oh, could he make it to dead center? Oh, he gets it dead center, 426 feet. Oh my goodness, that is a moonshot. Well, that wasn't actually, that was more like a pop-up that just barely went over the fence. Ah, now with a minute and 30 seconds or so, we are going to call timeout. I don't know, I just felt like now was a good time. <clears throat> oh, and he, he's fully juiced up for the last minute and 30 seconds. 344, right off the timeout. Oh, another one! Jeez, maybe he needed that Gatorade. That Gatorade give, gave him a better advantage. Oh, just short. Oh, home run, J.D. Martinez. That's his ninth. Had a lot of, I'm pretty sure it's four, three or four after he um had the timeout. So... That probably helped him out. Oh, and 332 feet to center field with 15 seconds left. Uh, now 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Maybe second to last if the ball hurries. 2, 1. Nah, that's the end with um, I, 10 home runs. Home runs. Okay, that was good. Jesus Hagelar. He's... Uh, Oh, just barely short. Okay. Oh, hits at the center. Hey, Zeus Aguilar. 390 feet on a second attempt. Oh. Oh, Homer, the dead center. That was really dead center. It was only like eight feet away from dead center. Like from 400, because it's 400 to center, so. Anyway, geez, with only two home runs, Jesus Aguilar struggling. And oh, I went with the normal swing there. And he gets it 388 feet into center field. Oh my goodness, he keeps scaring me. With a minute and 20 seconds left, gotta settle for the timeout. Get him fully out energized and um uh I'm pretty sure it's Ryan Braun I'm not completely sure that gave him his Gatorade but I'm not sure it didn't show the back but um Jesus Aguilar with three home runs and a minute left pretty much out of this contest but he wants to show him what he's got and oh jeez 10 seconds left. Oh, no. Nope. Three seconds left if the pitcher throws it. Oh, wow. They stopped him in the middle of his windup, but still. Wouldn't have came back. But J.D. Martinez with 10 home runs.
who advances. The two AL com um, opponents advance. And now Edwin Encarnacion, Seattle Mariners, who used to play for this Indians team. 431 feet. Another home run. Um, Edwin Encarnacion for his old fans. And of course, Blue Jay. But before he was on the Mariners, he was on this Indians. He was on the Indians team. Boom. Mm. Oh, yes, it is gone. That's gone. Into the oh, and it's a home it's run. A home run Yes, he did play for the Indians team. I, I knew that. I just didn't want to look stupid, but... Home run! Oh! Ho, ho. Very close. Oh! Oh! Go deeper! Mm, still not gone. Oh! Pulls that one too much. Going for dead center. Uh, pulls that one too much again, too. Gonna call a timeout with a minute and 11 seconds left. Uh, oh, I'm doing the handshake. Excuse me. And oh, he was almost full power. And boom. Oh, starts off the bat. 440. 14. Excuse me. Feet to dead center. Wow. Oh, oh, deep. Oh, if he wants to be in conversation, because Anthony Rizzo could catch up to this five. Oh, 418 feet. Edwin Encarnacion, not got high pitch. Oh, three seconds left. Um, and this is his last hit. Hits it to opposite field. And with six, um, six, yes, six, um, home runs. Anthony Rizzo hits it to left field, 395 feet. Got to go to right field. And oh, he hits it to center field this time, 437 feet. Anthony Rizzo. Oh, that was a low liner. Changed to three. Oh, hits the opposite field. Four hundred exactly. So left field opposite. Uh, Botaco. Three hundred and sixty-nine feet to right field. Oh my goodness, he blow that one right straight up. And oh, hits one to right field, 335 feet, Anthony Rizzo. Only one home run away from Edwin Encarnacion, and he was early on that pitch. Oh, oh, got that one perfectly, 390 feet. That's where I'm going to call my timeout. Oh my goodness. Bryce Harper giving him his Gatorade. And, by the way, not sponsored even, I'm bringing it up a ton. <laughs> um. Oh, and he pops that one up. Not a homer. Oh, I was way Running. too early there. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my goodness. Why am I, I was trying to go calmer. Normal swing and oh, hits it to opposite field. Foul though. Oh no. Oh my goodness, I'm missing these a ton. And Anthony Rizzo. Oh, the foul. With 24 seconds left. Oh. Oh, and he hits it. Not 100 and not. No, that wasn't 100 and not. That couldn't have been. But anyway, 398, I'm pretty sure. Home run to take this home. Wow. Um, Edwin Encarnacion hit a lot to left, and Rizzo hit a lot to right. Because Encarnacion's righty, and 
Rizzo's lefty, but that makes sense. Freddie Freeman. I kind of hope Bryce Harper takes this week. One, because he's from New Jersey. Huge Eagles fan. See him whenever I see the link. I always, when I ever see uh, Eagles home game. Oh, home run! Speaking, um, uh, but, because Mike Trout is, um, from New Jersey, big Eagles fan. I always shout, I always see him whenever I watch a home Eagles game. And geez, Freddie Freeman with three home runs to start. <laughs> I'm trying to be as fair as I can. And I'm trying to hit home runs, even though I want Mike Trout to win more. But, and oh, Rizzo, oh, not Rizzo, Freddie Freeman. It's not, <sighs> I'm sorry for this. And oh, 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 just barely short, Freddie Freeman. Oh, it's at center. Oh, 27, geez, 427 feet to dead center. Trying to go dead center again. Nope, he pulls it foul. Oh, hits it to left field this time and it's short. With two minutes left, Freddie Freeman hits it to center field, 415 feet, home run to dead center field. Freddie Freeman hits this one, 367 feet, just barely gone. Oh, I thought that one was just going to barely get out of there, but nope. Hits bounce and oh, 429 feet. And oh, hits another one, 410 this time on the button. And with a minute and 10 seconds left, I'm gonna call a timeout after that bad ground ball. Maybe showing um some um tiredness. That's not a word, but anyway. Oh, they're taking a selfie with each other without him, without those two. <laughs> the two um, Braves are mad about that, but they didn't even give him any. Okay, <laughs> I'm confused, but okay. Freddie Freeman, if only he didn't play Mike Trout. I mean, fouls it off. Because this would be an amazing against any other hitter, but oh, 10 home runs! But I mean, this is once in a lifetime kind of player that he's facing up against, so. Oh, good at every aspect of the game. Oh, hits it to for 447 feet to le right field. <laughs> Excuse me. 25 seconds left. Hits at the center. Oh, hits the wall with 10 seconds left. It's to right. Oh, no, 396 feet. Last hit. And he, nope, he does not get it. Hits in the warning track, but not over. And um, now Mike Trout, the once in a lifetime player. Oh, hey, it's fine. It's just a start. Oh, Mike Trout. Oh, just barely. Not enough power. Mike Cho hits it to left field. 427 feet. Okay. Oh. Oh. Hits it to left field. 481 feet. Feet. Oh, Mike Trout hits it deep. Another back to back. 409 feet. Mike Trout back to back to back with some late life. This is where we are going to call a timeout with Mike Trout with a minute and 50 left. Um, even though it's a lot of time, so he needs to be fresh after that back to back to back. And oh, he goes four back-to-backs in a row. And now he gets the 30-second bonus. Or did he? I'm not sure if he did. I'm pretty sure he did. But Mike Trout hits it to left field. 390 feet, just barely gone. Mike Trout, 440 feet. On a roll here with seven home runs. 
but a minute left. Well, many 30 seconds left, pretty much, because he has 30 extra seconds. That's plenty of time, unless he doesn't get a home run in this this last minute, pretty much. This last minute, 423.25 feet. Mike Trout back to back, 434 this time, and. Out of breath, and with nine home runs, he needs to get three home runs in the course of this next 30 second bonus. And now the 30 second bonus is starting now, or after this pitch. Oh, and he gets his 11th home run! 410, he has 30 seconds to hit two home runs. Oh, and that one doesn't go. Mike Trout. Oh my goodness, this would be a huge upset, but a good match. If Freddie Freeman won, and with eight seconds left, five seconds left, Mike Trout with the home run. Can he get the walk off here? Mike Trout! Oh, no, not gone. Now we're going to have to go to overtime, and uh, Freddie Freeman he hit him almost all the left side, the right side of the field, and Mike Trout hit him almost all to the left side of the field. That is, I've not seen that kind. Freddie Freeman up again with a minute left. Freddie Freeman hits it to left field, 447 feet. This would be a pretty big upset if Freddie Freeman beat Mike Trout. Both been raking today, but with uh, Freddie Freeman in the early life and had some end life, but Mike Trout with the huge middle life, he had a huge streak of like uh, four home runs in a row. He had like maybe like five six and ten I'm not sure the complete numbers but with s five seconds left I'm gonna call a timeout just so we can get his last hit only one home run now and oh Freddie Freeman hits it 399 feet <laughs> that voice crack but uh, uh, just barely with two home runs um, I probably should have used the timeout earlier but I don't know why I wasn't thinking of that. Uh, Mike Trout, 50 seconds left. Mike Trout hits it to left field, 393 feet. Home run. Oh. Mike Trout, 30 seconds left. Oh, and he hits that 393 feet to right field. Mike Trout. Oh, just misses it. Gonna call the timeout here. Be more aware of that. Has another timeout, so he has no time going off. They hit a home run, and he hits it right off the timeout. Four seconds left. Mike Trout advances to the next turn in a very close match. Even though Mike Trout was expected to win. Good job by Freddie Freeman for giving him a run for his money, tying him going to overtime and um only losing to him by um one home run which is amazing if you think about it because Mike Trout is an amazing player and JD Martinez versus Chris Davis no hits it foul Oh, JD Martinez hits it into the tunnel which leads to the concession stands I'm pretty sure 392 feet. Oh, as I was speaking, almost hit an oppo taco. Oh, oh, and he pulls it too much. Oh, no, he doesn't. 416 feet. I thought he pulled that foul. I need to see this replay. Oh, my goodness. That was a moonshot. When I'm super high, and it just barely reached by the foul pole. How? I have not seen that. It went like inside, in between, I'm pretty sure, like the edge, um, that foul pole. Because <laughs> if it hit it, it would have been a home run. But if it went a few inches to the left, it wouldn't have been a home run. And oh, J.D. Martinez hits it again. Another home run. And oh, he goes back to back to back JD Martinez in the semifinals he wants to go to the finals I don't blame him 412 feet 
60 <laughs> I can't even read anymore 14 416 feet oh my goodness I can't even speak I'm so hype Wow oh I was way too early for that and oh after a bad hit gonna call a timeout go over and six home runs he's completely fresh fouls it off start off bad start and oh he hits that one deep moonshot hits the foul pole 359 feet but that could have went way further if it didn't hit the foul pole you could hear the ding oh, no nah, doesn't get out one minute remaining 411 feet with 50 seconds remaining JD Martinez not showing any um tiredness at the end even though he he had just had the timer pretty much he's like halfway pretty much but oh 30 seconds left get another home run with these probably two more hits oh I was too early there and he has one more hit this is probably his last hit JD Martinez takes advantage of the last hit that's a home run! Wow, that was an intense round. Hit it. He split between the beginning. He hit some in the beginning, at the end, and um, in the middle. So wow, that was Chris Davis. And oh, oh, and he starts off the bat with a 419 feet foot home run. And oh, he hits another one! Back to back already! That was his second swing, already a second home run! Start off with a fast start. Oh, and he hits another one! Three home runs out of his first four swings! That is an amazing start! That's probably the best start we've ever had today. Oh, 400 feet! Oh my goodness! If he keeps at this rate, he's gonna beat JD Martinez with like less than, t like, but like more than a minute left. But five, he's already halfway to JD Martinez. Not even close to halfway. Um, in the time category, and oh, he keeps going at this rate, 416 feet this time. He pulled on them a little to the left, well, a ton to the left. He missed them a ton, but 4, 381 feet. Oh my goodness, another home run! Chris Davis showing that he can do it. Gonna call a timeout. I need a breather too. Oh, and now he hits this to left field. He's one home run off with almost, with a minute and 40 seconds left. He ties JD Martinez as uh, I just, my Wi-Fi connection just lost. I really hope I didn't lose this footage, but I don't care. Um, if I did, I'll be super mad. But if I don't, hey, you guys are still watching this video. So, ah, oh, with a minute and 30 seconds left. Chris Davis hits a walk-off home run with a minute and 23 seconds left. That was an amazing round. Um, not on JD Martinez's side, but Chris Davis had an amazing game. And wow, this was like a back and forth battle. I mean, no, no, it wasn't really, cause, but there were a few moonshots shot in the left foot. Anthony Rizzo up now up to bat against Mike Trout. Anthony Rizzo. Uh, <laughs> it's, I'm getting another notification that my Wi-Fi got lost. But, oh, Anthony Rizzo. If you need Wi-Fi to record this, I'm going to be so mad. But if you don't, then I'm going to be so happy because you guys are going to be hearing me right now. Yay. All right, Anthony Rizzo. It's at center. Ah, oh, I thought it, that was gonna go gone, but nope. Ah, oh. Anthony Rizzo was the best hitter when I hit it with him. When I hit with him, he hit a ton of liners, dribblers, cause oh, Anthony Rizzo. Ah, oh, nah, I went super high, but um, pretty far too, but like not the uh, not as uh, not far enough to get a home run.
I'll just say that. And wow, struggling with a minute, two minutes and 30 seconds left. Only one home run. It keeps hitting those. That was the second time he's hit it. And oh, Anthony Rizzo hits it. 356 feet <laughs> to left, to right field, excuse me. Wow. Oh, Anthony Rizzo. This is, with two minutes left, only two home runs hits a ton of those dribblers. And Anthony Rizzo! Gone! 400 feet on the dot. Oh, and he... Oh, I thought that was going to go. Gone. Just barely not gone. Three more... With a minute and 30 left, that's time to call the timeout. With Anthony Rizzo hopefully getting some, getting a nice sip and um, getting back onto the field to hit another home run. And oh, he does. I thought I jinxed him, but I guess I didn't. I just motivated him to, oh, just barely hit it off the wall. Like halfway Just up the wall, minute hit it. A minute remaining with four home runs. As I say that, he gets his fifth home run, 402 feet. But that's how I was saying. Now five home runs. That's gonna. Every time I say his home run count, he gets a home run. So now with six home runs, Anthony Rizzo, um, behind Trout, Trout should catch up to him. And um, um, six home runs, six home runs, six home runs. All right, no, it's not gonna work. But anyway, yeah, I'm getting early for these. But I was um, pretty good. Started off with four home runs, and then I got to five and six. And all oh, with eight seconds left, he's not gonna have enough time. This is his last swing. Four, three hundred and forty-five feet. Anthony Rizzo, I'm standing up. If there was a face cam on me, I'd be out of it half, maybe more than half of. This is just super hype. And Mike Trout now up with. Has to get eight home runs to advance to face Chris Davis in the finals. That's not the best start, but hopefully he's like the other and gets, oh, 427 feet. As I say, he doesn't have the best start. On his second swing, he gets a home run. That's a pretty good start. I mean, I guess today it's not the best, but oh, he um, popped that one up. Uh oh, my trout. Ah, that's the MLB The Show 19 logo. Ah. Three minutes to go. Oh, my trout! Oh, it hits the screen on the wall. And oh, my trout hits it to dead center field. 428 feet, Mike Trout. All right. Oh, with the third home run, 400 feet. This time, and oh, my Trout hits it to center. Oh, just barely a few feet away. My Trout. Oh. Okay, Mike Trout hits it to left field. Oh. All right, with two minutes left. Two um, minutes remaining. Um. Uh, he's gonna hit this one. Nope. Foul. Okay, home run, 420 feet, Mike Trout with a minute and 30 left, um, hits it to the right, uh, right after he misses that one, I'm gonna call a timeout, he's gonna get a break, um, I'm gonna, um, hopefully be ready for this other half with a minute and 20 seconds left 412 feet right out of the timeout oh it's five home runs he has to get uh, i just one minute remaining oh i thought that was gonna go out but um means uh um three home runs so yeah 
to take this home. With 45 seconds left, he needs two more home runs. He gets the tying home run, 414 feet. This is a close game, fellas. Oh, that was early with 25 seconds left. Mike Trout hits the walk off. Oh, that. It's a little nerve-wracking in the end, but Mike Trout against Chris Davis. These are two different... Well, these actually... Um, they've all had different runs. Like, the first time, Mike Trout had, like, a good early middle run, and then last time he had, um, like, scattered. Like, these guys have both had scattered runs. They haven't had the best, like, oh, 385 feet as I am talking. Mike Trout hits it to center. Oh, three, 439 feet. This time to dead center field. Mike Trout hits it deep. 402 feet. This is pretty much coming to a home run derby video. I just forgot that this is an Astros um, uh, franchise series. <laughs> So yeah, I don't know if we're gonna play the All-Star game, but maybe we'll do the moments or something like that! My child with 420 feet home run! With um, 2 minutes and 30 seconds, he's already super tired, gotta take the time out. Jeez, he lost his energy fast. Uh, I'm not sure why, and he's not even fully juiced up. Oh, two minutes left. Two minutes oh, minutes. he goes deep! 457 feet! Almost hitting the Jumbotron! Uh, 50 feet away from 500. The lucky number. And a baseball home run! Uh, he's getting pretty close. He's got a ton of warning track power hits, wall hits. Oh, 405 feet! Mike Trout! Oh, another home run! This time, 392 feet. Pretty close to each other. Just like a few sections away from each other. Like, one section of the... Oh, and ah, oh, short. 55 seconds left. Ah, oh, with eight home runs. I'm not sure if he's going to get away with this against Chris Davis. He's been playing really good. And he's already running out of more energy. He's like running energy super quick in this final round. Left. Maybe it's because the fatigue from the, all the other rounds, but it's a home run! 425 feet! Mike Trout hits that one. Zoom in on the ball. There, nine home runs with 20 seconds left! As I said, 10th yeah. home run for 410 10 feet, five, 5 seconds left, nope, that's going to be his last hit with 10 home runs, Mike Trout, that's a pretty good, um, a pretty good, um, home run, that's a pretty good, I mean, number, Chris Davis goes, oh, early there, well, last time he beat J.D. Martinez with a minute and 30 seconds left to add 10 home runs, <coughs> And he starts off with a big <coughs> home run, another one! <coughs> I'm so hyped. Don't worry, I'm fine, but oh my goodness. <sighs> my throat's starting to hurt because I'm getting so hyped. Yelling, standing up now. Uh, my palms are sweating too. Jeez, that's how hyped this video has been, even though you wouldn't think simulating the season would be that hyped, and it's not, but. Going for this home run derby, it's really hype. <sighs> oh, uh, Chris Davis, short. Oh, he hits that one. Ah, oh, nope, 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 nope. All right, with two minutes left, Chris Davis with the struggle. Maybe I jinxed him, but as I say that, 427 feet. With a minute and 50 seconds left! And oh, as I say, he's slumping! He gets back with 450 feet! He has another one! Back to back to back! Now he comes up to five home runs! He has a minute and 30 seconds to get six home runs to take the lead! Oh my goodness, I checked swing there. Now that's gonna make me call the timeout. With a minute and I'm pretty sure 20 seconds left. 
uh, almost. Um, he gets a break. <sighs> a minute and 20, yes. He needs five home runs and he checks away. He wastes the timeout. Why is he checks away? I am not sure why. Oh, I was way early for that one. All right. No, a minute left. Oh, minute. hits that one. Oh, that was how? What? That was short. Okay. Oh, it's a high pitch, but still goes 375 feet. Chris Davis. Wow. That went high. Just somehow got over the fence and with 30 seconds left. With, he needs five home runs. That's going to be pretty hard. But as I say that, 413 feet with 20 seconds left. He needs four home runs. It's pretty much physically impossible. Yes, with 10 seconds left. Chris Davis trying to make his last hopes, but nope. Can't do anything with two seconds left. They stopped him in the middle of his windup, which I hate. And Mike Trout with a lousy eight in the second round. Um, Chris Davis uh, scored him first. But Mike Trout with the um, home run derby champion. Uh, Chris Davis outscored him, but not in the final. The final, um, he just couldn't prevail. I don't know what happened, but um, he just couldn't. So, sorry guys, um, it just stopped. That may have been over an hour of recording, I am not sure, but, um, um, yeah, I don't know, but, um, um, I guess, um, um, Cesar Hernandez makes all-star team, I'm surprised. Um, I may choose one of my Phillies, um, um, why not? Don't see a lot of catcher gameplay. I will play as JT Real Muto. I'll play lock as him. Um, uh, no. Um, just waiting for this game to start. And, uh, that gives you guys some time to hit the subscribe button. So, all-star game. Getting close um, to first pitch here. I'm getting Let's close to first to pitch here. Three. 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 Oh, it's a home run. Three. 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 Oh, and uh, I'm going to start. Three. Yep, now I am starting. JT Real Muto coming up to bat. Let's try to go deep, JT. Oh my goodness. Alright, yeah. If I were him, I'd throw another inside pitch. So, watch. Oh my goodness, I was way too early for that one. Was not expecting the slider, even though I guessed that pitch. I thought it was going to be inside, so. And I didn't see it. Oh, jeez. Then he comes back with the fastball. That's a smart pitch, pitch idea. And, uh, went for the slider. And he goes for the slider down the middle. Okay. JT hits it to right field. They're running on it. They miss it. Got to go back to first. Um, and I get safely to first. JT Real Muto. Manager says to steal with Javier Baez up to bat. Well, that's what's so Go! As a JT Riamuto, bad jump. Oh, and he gets walked. Oh, this is a full count. I'm not sure. Why not? Why not? Seal! He hits it. Infield fly rule. Uh, Got to get back, and I couldn't get back. The double play, ah, that wasn't smart on my part, but anyway. JT Remuto, the two outs, bases loaded. Gonna go for a contact. Swing, ah, oh, hit that foul, hit the camera. Seems that was. Alright. 
Another Philly up. Second, Bryce Harper. I blooped that one. That's what I wanted. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, he saved. JT Miyamoto runs out. That's why you hustle, kids. All right. I play baseball myself. I'm all for hustling. I hustle all the way to first base as long as I can. Hey, that's why. Because you think you're going to hit a blooper here. You're going to jog. And then you see the, the second baseman make an amazing play and throw on his leg to first. But he beat that out because he sprinted. Okay, like, it um, you can slouch after you're on base. Like, um, so you shouldn't slouch here. before you get on base, because unless you don't want to get on base, you should, um, you should, um, uh, hustle it out. It also makes you a good player. No, I'm going to run towards there. Oh, no, what the? Oh, he didn't go home, but eh. All right, that ends the inning. Um, oh, I guess I'm going to play catcher. Oh, and he's out at home plate. Good job by Richards. And oh, now I am up to bat. Now we got someone who can run on first. Oh, oh, JT hits that for a base hit. Throws it to second, but he cannot get him. And JT. Shoot, I thought he was going to steal, so that's why. Oh. And he, he's going, um, he I think, nope, he's not, he's staying at uh, second, I will stay at first. I'm a very aggressive and runner and, and hitter, that's why I miss a ton, and the two strikes left. Oh, he swings for that one, I'm going to run all the way home. Oh, oh, he caught that, caught that, he caught that. That ends the inning. Another bat for JT Realmuto. In the ninth. Sorry, and oh wow. AL up 13 to 1. And wow. At least for their own stats, you can't uh, mill in your chances as a professional. It's very low, and um, I'm going to switch this real quick. Sorry about this. Okay, I just had to change the guest pitch because I had no idea that that was super low. Alright, I'm guessing a ton of pitches. And JT. Real Muto. Oh, the first. Oh, JT can run the down. Oh, no, the pitcher runs him out. And that's the first out. That's probably going to be the end of this. Oh, no. Oh, no. I get another at bat in the ninth. All right, NL stars making a comeback, sort of. With two outs and a blaze is loaded. Oh, way early though. Change up. Thinking of the curve. And got some speed at first. Oh, that should go into the dirt. Send him! Send him! Send him! Send him! Go! Go! And he slides! He's safe at home! There's a runner at second and third. Now we have two runners in scoring position. And it's a 6-13 to 13 game. I am glad I chose to change up low. Because now it's a 1-1 one, one count. And it could be any possibilities! Oh! Curveball. That embarrassed me. Um, probably would throw another one in that area. But I don't know. And JT shouldn't have swung at that. And oh, I guess I should have. <clears throat> oh, not in time. Oh, and yes, I get safe by second. Get in two runs. I knew he was going home, so I thought he would throw home. And I went to second base. And now I am safe. Um, two, two count with Javier Baez up to bat. Going to steal. Why not? Oh, and that is strike three. The AL Stars get out of here with a win.
come out of here with a win. Uh, but the NL Super NL Stars, All Stars, make a comeback in the ninth with um with um seven runs. I'm pretty sure in the ninth inning. Um, wow, that was a pretty nice comeback. But still, that's the end of that game, and now we're going back to the boring part. <laughs> Simulating to the end of the season. I did not expect this game, this video to be so hectic, but it's, uh, alright. Yep, I know. Um, still, we're gonna simulate to end of September before the. Alright, alright, so I will see you guys, um, once we get to the, um, final, to, uh, once we get to the, um, uh, last series trade deadline Garrett Cole traded to the Mariners we traded what I have no idea what oh I guess final year but still now the end um the Astros finish um 98 and 64 uh uh point six six hundred five team over 500 which is good um and we'll be taking on the Royals in the division series all right all right, I want to see this Royal series. All right, we're gonna sim after this first two games. Oh, the first two games are wins. Now we are going to sim. Oh, the Astros sweep the Kansas City um, Rays. Um, in the oh my goodness, can you stop? Oh my goodness. All right, thank you. Um, but. Uh, we beat the Kansas City Royals. Oh my gosh, Kansas City Royals. <laughs> I I don't have a problem with Madden's music because I mean Madden music is um it's not as loud as this music. Like it's incredibly loud. And oh my goodness. Okay, thank you. All right, now it's one and one. I'm trying to talk. All right, <laughs> we'll just ignore this. Um, but the background. Oh my goodness, I'll just switch it. Um, all right, so we win one and lose one now against the um, you know. Uh, New York Yankees. Oh my goodness. Um, um. Now we win two and lose one, and um. Oh, oh, and it's a two-two series against the Yankees. We take a W. And now let's see. Then oh, we lose to the Yankees. And this is going and oh, we lose to the Yankees. So. Um, yeah, that's pretty much gonna be this video. Um, oh my goodness, can you be quiet? Thank you. Um, alright, this, this song's fine. <laughs> but, um, anyway, it's quiet enough. But anyway, um, thank you guys for watching this stupid video. Um, it was pretty much just, um, the All-Star game. And, um, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, this music, oh my gosh. <sighs> I'm fine with the music. I mean, this isn't bad soundtrack. It's just super loud. That's the only problem. Like, I want to be able to talk to you guys. But anyway, it's totally off topic. Topic. Um, but thank you guys for watching this video. If you finished at the end, um, comment down below um, that you're an OG. And um, once you comment down OG, um, you should have also subscribed. So press um, um, comment OG down in the comment section below, and um, um, I will have a lucky winner. And um, I don't know. I'll see what I'll do to with the lucky winner. But if I get enough people down in the comments below to um, 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 comment OG. Which you, that means you either finish the video, well, then that means you finish this video and subscribed. So if you're listening to this right now, subscribe and you could um, win something. I'll find uh, something. Maybe I'll subscribe to your channel, something like that. If you guys um, are a YouTuber and you want to get um, shout it out, um, I can help your YouTube channel out a little bit. And as long as you can help my channel out a little bit. So, um, yeah, maybe I'll, I'll, I may do just a shout out, but anyway, um, thank you guys for watching this video, I mean, it's pretty much just all-star, home run derby, I mean, it wasn't really anything about the Astros, but like, I guess I did the first clip, but anyway, um, thank you guys for watching this video, um, again, for a lot of times, um, sub once you subscribe, um, comment OG down below, and, um, yeah, I'll, um, I will, um, 
maybe shout you out in a video. So, um, like I said a ton, thank you for watching this video, and um, um, it's been me signing out. Um, if you like this MLB The Show, um, hit the like button. Um, if you want to see more MLB The Show, if you want to, um, I know I said I was going to do some um, non-sports games, which I have um, a game that I'm going to come out with, a video com that I'm going to come out with sometime, hopefully this week, maybe not, but um, I'm just trying to post as often as I can without like um, doing too much, because I tend to get a little lazy, but anyway, um, uh, it's been me, I'm signing out for now, peace.